what I'm saying? I know I ain't did a video in a long time, but you know, I always want to be about the spirit whenever I do a video. You know what I'm saying? Uh, first and foremost, I want to say God bless y'all. God bless everybody on here. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I pray that y'all be well. I pray that y'all be blessed. You know what I'm saying? I want to thank my Father in heaven that sit on the highest thrones of the heaven. You know what I'm saying? I want to thank him for being my provider, Jehovah Jireh. I think I want to thank him for being everything that I need in life. You know what I'm saying? I want to thank my Father in heaven for being everything that I need in life. You know, because without him, we ain't got nothing. You know what I'm saying? Without 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 our heavenly Father, we ain't got nothing. You know what I'm saying? Um, and again, I know I ain't been on here in a while, but you know I don't ever do videos just to say I did a video. I always do videos, but when I do my videos, I always want to be led by the Spirit. When I do my YouTube videos, you know what I'm saying? Um, so the Lord led me to come on here. You know the title of this video is having faith in the fire. You know I'm hearing the, I'm hearing the Spirit of the Lord. It ain't ba 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 ba. See. I'm going to keep it a buck with you, you know, me and my family. We done been through hell and back. And I'm not talking about since I've been, I'm talking about just in general. You know what I'm saying? The spiritual war, war happened up. The attacks. But at the end of the day, God faithful. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? We covered by the blood of the lamb. You know what I'm saying? See, if there's one thing about me, I'm always grateful. I'm always thankful. You know what I'm saying? And I hear the Lord, Lord, when we get in prayer. Father God, I want to thank you for this day. I want to thank you for this time of fellowship and worship with your people. I pray right now in your name, Lord God, that you will strengthen us, give us peace. In your name we pray, amen. So, all right, what you need? Because I'm doing a video. So, like I was saying, uh, you know, when you when you going through a, a rough time in life, you know what I'm saying? Uh, trials and tribulations, they going to come. You know, trials and tribulations, they going to come. Stop biting me, chat. Stop. Get out of here. Come here. Come here. Get over here. Trials and tribulations, they're going to come. You know what I'm saying? But what you always got to remember is, no matter how big the obstacle is, no matter how much the warfare is, God will give you rest. He'll give you peace in a time of trouble. He'll give you rest in a time of trouble. He'll bless you even when you're going through hell. You know what I'm saying? The reason why I say, you know, I always want to be transparent is because you know, at the end of the day, I'm not perfect. My wife not perfect. My daughter, my 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 family, they none of us perfect. You know what I'm saying? Still, the reason why I try to be so transparent all the time is because I be trying to let people know I got struggles just as much as some of y'all do. You know what I'm saying? I struggle with things in my life just as much as y'all do. I ain't Superman. I ain't no... Oh, superhero prophet. Ain't none of us perfect. We all wretched people in need of a savior. I'm just a nobody trying to tell everybody about somebody. You know what I'm saying? See, what I've been trying to do is I've been having to ask God for patience. You know, I can be honest. When I when I see my son, let me, let me explain something to you. See, when it comes to witchcraft attacks, okay, they attack me, that's one thing, but... I see my son getting attacked, he an infant. I ain't even got to go there, but you know what I'm saying. That type of stuff will set you off, you know. And I've been having to ask God, you know, I can keep it a buck with you. The same witch that attacked my son, something happened to her bad. And the Lord showed me, he told me. You know, he literally told me. He told me what happened. And I be trying to tell people. You trying to take our soul, but you don't even know 
the judgment that God will bring on you, it'll be that much more greater. And I'll be trying to tell folks, you don't want to mess with God's children. Because you may get you may get away with it for a little while, but God will find you and he will tear your behind up. And I'm just keeping a buck with you. I'll be trying to tell folks, you don't want to do that, bro. See, don't learn a lesson. Do me a favor. It's 186 people on here. It should be 186 likes on here right now. In Jesus' name. But again, all that is to say this. When you're going through hell, when you're going through, you know what I'm saying, uh, all out, all out calamity, let me explain something to you, bro. God is not the author of confusion. See, the reason why God allows us to go through so much pain and suffering, see, and this is a word, this is a word right now, I'm hearing the Lord speak. Y'all about to get blessed financially. It's a financial breakthrough coming. And I know it's for me as well, because I'm going to tell you, when you going through pain, suffering, you just feeling like it's hopeless, you feeling like ain't nothing good finna go to you, ooh, you better open up your eyes, because God about to bless you beyond your wildest dreams. Beyond your wildest dreams, bro. I'm trying to tell you. God is about to bless y'all like you ain't never seen before. Ooh, Jesus, I hear you. That cancer you've been battling with, speak to it. You got power in the name of Jesus. You ain't got cancer, you cancer free. You ain't got no brain tumors, you brain tumor free. That tumor in your head is benign. Matter of fact, it's destroyed in Jesus' name. Ah, I hear you, Holy Ghost. But oh, ba, 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 ba. I see an angel of the Lord. I see an angel of the Lord giving somebody look like out of the mouth of God. The spiritual bread that we need is what will sustain us. He showed me that scripture right now. I prepare a table in the presence of your enemies. Your cup runneth over. Our cup about to overflow. We about to experience the goodness of God. Shut up. We about to experience the goodness of God. Like we ain't never seen for Blessings of the Lord is about to hit our home. Like we ain't never seen before. God about to elevate us in this season. There's a time frame where the Lord's saying, position yourself. Position yourself for the breakthrough. And I hear the Lord. Don't be occupied about no crypto right now. You need to stay in your word. You need to stay in your word. God ain't even, he ain't even, he stay in your word. This ain't, this ain't even about no crypto. The Lord says stay in your word. Because the words will help. In the word, you will stay and be able to hear his voice. And when you hear his voice, you won't miss what he got for you. Even if it is dealing with crypto or this or with that. And I'm just letting the Lord speak. You know what I'm saying? Um, but again, I say this to say, when we go through stuff, it's a growing process. God will bless us, and I don't care. What, I know he going to bless us. You got to speak that word out to yourself. Even though it may look like God ain't going to bless you, just know that he is because he is El Shaddai, Adonai, Elohim, Abba, the Father, the great God, Almighty, Jehovah, Mechadish, Jehovah, Nishi, Jehovah, Jesus, Christ, Nazareth, Yeshua, Hamashiach, Yahweh, the line of Judah, Emmanuel, Adonai, Jah, Yah, he is yod he vav he. he is the one who was, who is, who is to come. He is the Alpha, the Omega, the first and the last, the beginning and the end. But he also the middle because he in the middle. He ain't just the first and the last. He in the middle. Say God is saying yesterday, today, today and forever. He the God of the heavens. He the judge. He the judge of all judges. He the father of all fathers. He the God of gods. He the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. He the, he is. He the Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. It has a father, and it's the most high. And where does faith come from? It comes from the most high. See, don't speak doubt. Even though it's easy to speak doubt, don't speak no doubt to yourself in this season. Only speak faith, because faith is, is the evidence of things that we can't see. It's the substance of things hope for. You feel me? That word that the Lord give you, 
It comes to sustain you, to keep you going, to get you through them tough times. Look, I'm going to say, look, I'm going to keep it a buck with you. I know, I know for a fact, I know for a fact, I understand what it's like being in a drought, going through all our hell, asking the Lord, God, please bless me. And it seems like ain't nothing happening. God will bless you. But you just got to hold on to your faith. The reason why your faith getting attacked is because you got great faith. Think about this. If God wasn't going to do something, why would the devil be telling you it's not going to happen in the first place? If the devil telling you God not going to bless you, that should tell you that he is going to bless. That should motivate you to keep you going. Even though it's easier said than done. It's tough. I get it. Don't give up. I see people on here dealing with suicidal thoughts. You want to just end it all because you feel like God ain't here. You God ain't changing your situation. God says today. He says, I'm intervening today. He says, I'm intervening today. He says, I'm breaking strongholds today. The Lord says, I'm delivering you today. Mm, Jesus, I hear you. He says, I'm delivering you today. He says, I'm delivering you today. He says, trust in the Lord with all your heart. And I hear, I hear what the Lord's saying. He said, lean not on your, lean not onto your own understanding. So even though it may seem like you don't understand what's going on, don't lean on your own understanding because his thoughts is not our thoughts. His ways is not our ways. All the people that the, the people that call me false prophets and this and that, let them say what they want to say. Let them say what they want to say. Let them let them talk. I see some of y'all in the comments. Y'all be defending me. Let me explain something to you. The Bible says, "Don't argue with a fool." Don't let them talk. Because you know who my vindicator is. It's Jesus. That's who my vindicator is. Because people that have the spirit of the Lord, all they got to do is pray. They don't recognize me in the spirit. Best thing you can do is stay humble and keep following the Lord and trusting him with all your heart, your power, your might. Let the spirit of the Lord continue to sustain you. Say, man, shall not live by red alone, but by every word that proceedeth out of the mouth of God. God going to bless his children because God is faithful. Because I've seen God be faithful in many situations where I thought I would never finna make it out. 